Okay, we've told y'all about praying mantis infestations in Christmas trees this year. There have been many, but one family had a a different surprise inside of their tree this year. Yeah, ABC's Danny New explains this one. I am literally freaking out right now. Do you notice the set of eyes that Brett Ingram of Dallas, Texas is reacting to? I just stopped. Uh, I didn't move because I didn't know what it was yet. I was just kind of like, what is that? I have no idea how this possum got in my house. This was a few weeks ago when Brett got home from her second day at a new job, which is already very stressful. And then you factor in, I don't know, finding a marsupial in your Christmas tree. Maybe he just loves Christmas. Maybe. I do have a really nice tree. Hey, little buddy, how did you get in my house? So what would you do if you found a possum just playing ornament? Well, Brett called her boyfriend, who was working out of state that night, of course. He told me where the rubber gloves were, so I went and got them and tried to kind of get him out. Um, well, he wasn't wanting to. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> and then Brett says she called a wildlife expert who told her she didn't do house calls at night and to just grab him herself. So it was back to the gloves. He did pop to the ground and then immediately run under my couch. Meanwhile, Brett was garnering millions of views on TikTok for these videos, which she said she actually thought she was sending to her friends on Snapchat. Suddenly, the whole world was invested in how she was going to handle Mr. Claus. I to try to get him, and then he ran under the other couch. This process happened like five times. Eventually, Brett did finally get Mr. Possum into her arms, and he was shockingly kind of calm. Now, and I opened my door, and I set him right down, and he walked right out. You're really cute. But now Brett kind of misses him and almost wishes that she kept him. I am an animal lover, but he was full grown. If it was a baby, I think it would have been a different story. Now, there was one frequent comment on the TikTok video I want to address. For the record, the possum most likely would not have given Brett rabies because possums are actually incredibly resistant to rabies. In fact, the CDC says that less than 1% of rabies cases are found in possums. But still, probably always call animal control first. In New York for ABC News, I'm Danny New.